Hi guys, welcome to DIY Ideas. Today I want to show you how to make a really cool promo star. So we had this in a haul video a while ago. I hope you guys remember. If you didn't, um, feel free to take a look at that as well. Um, so yeah, for today we have here the promo stars. So this is the paper poetry edition from the brand Rico Designs. And that's where we get our wool too, so there's different motives and patterns in this one. I like that the paper is um, pressed in such a 3D way so that the pop-ups and the pressed in parts fit perfectly into each other while folding. And I hope it works as it's supposed to, so we have a total of 10 stars. Um, yeah, so 5 times a different pattern into widths, so let's get to it. Here are the instructions too in different languages and typed up, so we need 4 stripes per star. Oh, cool! Um, so yeah, here it says Magical Christmas, how nice! And we have the thin and the thick stripes, so 1.5 cm and 2.5 cm, um, depending on how thick you want your star to be or how big you want it to be. So yeah, I'll leave the thick ones out and I'll be using one of the thinner stripes. I think you can see it better that way. So let's see which one we would like. Um, I think I'm gonna do the pink glitter um, with polka dots. So here are the five stripes. They're too long to fit into the screen, so let's fold them in half. So take care that the pop-up or the 3D part is away from the middle on top, since it's going to be the opposite on the other side. Um, so yeah. I hope um, that's a clear explanation, so one more time, when I turn it around, you see where they are, so make sure that side looks away from you. So we go through the opening on top. Here is the opening on the bottom. Around number one and through number three. So almost like making an interesting pie crust. Um, we have one, number two going through number one. Um, then we have number 3 through 2 and 4 to keep, to keep it all together, so around 1 and through number 3. So let's pull them together until we get a square in the middle. So now we will fold the upper side and fold over, repeat for all four sides. The last one, not just over but through, so you'll find a little opening, a little pocket.
Now you can see the glitter elements, so I will fold them backwards so that they are parallel with the side pieces. Then downwards. Around the first point. Push through the pocket. So here where the pocket is. And that's how we have our first pointy part. So let's turn this around and start again. So this is our last one. Here we don't have a pocket visible, it's under the stripe, so make sure you look for it under there. We're done, so let's turn it around, and here you can notice that the middle has no glitter parts, so that's where we come in now. Do the same, um, but now on the other side. So now we have 8 pieces, so 4 per side, and yeah, now we're missing some additional ones. Although these glitter very nicely, I hope you can notice the effect. So the upper piece, no matter which side, goes down. Then the left goes over, fold it upwards. Put up a twist around here through the pocket. That's how it goes, so keep going.
And now comes the last side, so do the same thing all over again. If it doesn't go through the pocket, um, you can fold it a bit pointier, that can help. And we are now done, we just need to cut the leftover pieces out. And here's our star, so I have to say this is my favorite decoration piece for this Christmas season. I hope you guys like it too. Um, let me know in the comment section if you maybe have some other star ideas or if you did some um, other type of star. Or if you did this one maybe in a different color or a different way, let me know how you made it. And yeah, if you liked the video and you'd like to see more, feel free to shoot a thumbs up and you can also subscribe to our channel, that way you'll never miss any new videos that we post. And yeah, thanks for watching, I hope to see you soon and until then, have a great day! Bye!